Hello and welcome back to a brand new episode of Hermitcraft Amplified and today, where are we? We are at Hermit Thrills yet again. Now I really like going back and forth between projects, like coming over to Hermit Thrills, doing some things, doing stuff like the rabbit over there, and then going back to my base and doing some stuff over there and then in the nether, and places like that. I really like changing it up so I hope you guys do not mind that. But today we have been given the task by Tango to do some stall stuff. Um, some little stalls, some little decorative places around the area and he mentioned that he wanted them like around this area here. Um, he put up a little cobblestone pillars or, well, the stone pillar over here is one of them. He wants four stalls but I've actually tweaked it a little bit just because I don't necessarily think they're the best places for them but we will see exactly how this is going to go. Now this here is one of the stalls. There's also a matching one over there. One I believe will be red and white and the next one will be yellow and white. Just, you know, so it matches in with the, the colour scheme that is going on. We've even got some yellow um, and red designs going on with the uh, with some of the, the rides and, and kind of amusements around the area. But anyway, yeah, so I'm going to get on and design these. Now, I have chosen a few blocks, which I'm not exactly the most comfortable with. If we go in here, you'll take a quick look. Is it in this chest or this chest? Yeah, I've got I've got some wool, obviously. I've got some of the red and the yellow that I will need. But I've also got a poop ton of quartz. Because this is what we're going to be using for the main frame of the stools. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of quartz, I will just tell you now. Um, I mean, it's okay, it's good for like very, very fancy things, but I'm not sure if it's gonna work with these stools. So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead, we're gonna try and build at least one of these guys um, to show you guys, and then we'll build the other one, and then I guess we're gonna do some decor decorative stuff around the area as well. Not quite sure exactly what yet, but I have something in mind using Podsol, which could be interesting. Okay, so I'm just going along here, and I have no idea when these episodes are gonna be out, but yeah, let's just let's just leave Biffa to it. <laughs> I might see if he wants some help in a second. I just need to go and grab some blocks from my base. And uh yeah, he's <laughs> it'll be back soon. Slip, he's destroying your portal. You better get him back or something. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. But you might be able to hear something that's going on. Spoilers, but um yeah, I better head back and gather the blocks I need to get. Okay, so I have actually made a little bit of the stall. Now this is just one of them. Uh, this one's going to be red, I believe. Actually, you know what? I think I might swap that. I might make this one the yellow one, since it's right next to the boombox, which, which is red already. So that might be a bit too much red over this side. But here we have it. It's a very, very small stall, but I think it works pretty well. Now, we're going to have to get the roof on it. Now, I believe... Uh, I was going to use spruce, but I seem to have nether brick fences in there already. So maybe these won't work. Might be a bit dark. But I'm sure that's fine. We'll just use red for now. Actually, you know, we'll, we'll change up the top to be um, yellow, which is what we want. But what I'm going to be doing is putting fences along here. And then I believe if I do this correctly, if I'm able to jump up, that would be very helpful uh, up here. Uh, this one's going to have to be coloured and that one's going to be yellow. Yellow might be a bit of a funky colour. Maybe I'll change the wall colour in my texture pack. And, uh, well, I mean, I guess that would mean that everyone else would have to deal with the yucky kind of yellow colour. But that's fine. I'm sure they can... Uh, they're cool with that. So, this is what it looks like. So, it's going to go like that. I believe it'll then probably come up one and then maybe even once more and then go along the front. Um, like so. So, there's three. Then, <laughs> and then we experiment by doing this. Aha! That should, that might work. That might work. This might look quite cool. Let me quickly just do this end of it. Um, so, we'll make it kind of stick out. And that, that one went in the wrong place. But I believe this might actually work pretty well to the top. I believe that that's, that's kind of a good shape. I think if I get rid of this one here. I don't know what you're doing there. I need some shears or something. But, yeah, that's not too bad. I think I was going to put something like um, fences. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm really failing at blazing today. I think I was going to put some fences along there. Uh, could actually even put some fences along here as well. Maybe I'll put that further in. Not sure just yet. Bashy, you know what? That doesn't look too bad. I might add some more detail here and there, but in general, that doesn't look too bad. All I want to do now is change all of these. Now I'm gonna, yeah, maybe. You know what? I was gonna just use the what clay, the coloured clay for the back of it, but I might actually use that for where the wool is up there as well, and just leave um, the 
carpet, the yellow carpet. Because uh, obviously you can't make half slabs out of clay yet. Um, so hopefully they maybe introduce that. But I think that'll be fine if we do something along that. Yeah, that, that'll look pretty cool. And then we'll make these clay as well. And just generally, I think that'll look pretty cool. So I'm going to get along and make this. We'll add some finishing touches. We'll even add like a little something in the back. I don't know what these stores going to be for exactly yet. But I'm sure I can maybe even put them up for higher for the other hermits to actually sell their own stuff, I guess. Well, here we have it. I have built the two of them, and I believe they look pretty cool, so we're going to slowly pan backwards to take a look at the two. There is a bit of a staircase behind me, though, so I'm going to be going down a little bit, but here we are. Look at them. They look a little bit like McDonald's kind of stalls or something, <laughs> but um, I don't know. I kind of I like them. I really, really do like them. I think they're kind of small, but they've got quite a lot of design going on. Now, I don't think it's too much. Um, I was worried that maybe... I've gone a bit over the top yet again. <laughs> it's generally, I guess, what I do design-wise. <laughs> I go a bit over the top with, with little projects like this. But I had a lot of fun, um, uh, you know, just playing around with them, I think. They look pretty cool. But now I need to think about what else we need to add around this area. One thing I do really want to do now, I'm going to have a look to see if there's any possible designs. Because I've not done designed something like this before. But like a little ice cream truck. I think that that would be pretty cool somewhere around the place, but I don't believe there is actually really a place for it yet, although here could be quite nice, you know, because that's quite a small area, that's not really going to be used for anything, it doesn't really block anything, because you'll be coming up here from this angle. Um, so maybe one here facing this way, so it'd be attached to the path here, and then you'd walk up and queue up for your ice cream at the ice cream truck, maybe, or even just maybe another truck, maybe a, a hot dog stand or something, I don't know. I think I'm going to try something out. And uh, we're just going to slowly, I guess, merge our way out from from the entrance there, all the way across. And uh, and start kind of building little things here and there. Now, I don't really want to take over big areas like this. Although, we do have a little creeper friend, which I don't seem to have my bow on me. Don't come, don't come over here. No, what are you doing? Hey, no. Bad creeper. Bad creeper. <laughs> Go away. I won't, uh, uh, yeah, I'm not going to leave any creeper. Re really? Okay, well, apparently it's Creeper par Paradise right now. You can't see me. No, 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 don't blow the stairs up, please. No, no, no. Um, if you guys weren't at my stream the other day, um, I was accidentally blown up by Creeper just, uh, just, just there. Yeah, in front of Ender Games. So, just, yeah, bad things happened. But I fixed the redstone, so we should be all good on that hand. Um, and yeah, it's all good. But anyway, yeah, let me look up some designs possibly for this. Uh, we'll tweak some things in creative, um, and maybe build one ourselves if we can come up with a cool idea. I've just got a feeling that a hot dog right on top of the little, uh, car could look kind of cool. Although, Minecraft blocks generally make that a whole bunch harder. So, I've come up with a cool design for the ice cream truck, and I believe that we're probably gonna put it, I believe, it, yeah, I think if we have it nice and close to this, we can actually move this up one if we need to there, but I believe it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight long. Hmm, we might need to move it over a tad, tad bit, just over to here maybe, maybe even start there, and we can actually get rid of a couple off the end, that'll be perfect I think. So I'm going to go ahead, we're going to time lapse this thing, and uh, hopefully it turns out pretty good. Okay, well the ice cream truck is now done. We have a pretty cool looking thing right here. I believe this thing looks pretty epic. I really, really like it. Um, I hope you guys do too. Now it's a bit of a mixture of two different designs that I actually found. Um, one of which Corralis actually has a tutorial on, and the other, I, I don't even know where I saw it, I just saw it somewhere, I don't even know, <laughs> I don't believe it actually had a name with it, so I couldn't even credit the person even if I knew, sadly. 
So um, yeah, it's a very, very cool design. I'm really, really happy with how it looks. And then we've also got our final little stall designs, which I am a massive fan of. Also, I should mention that is meant to be an ice cream on the top of the van because, well, that's how you build ice creams in Minecraft. <laughs> Cube-like. But anyway, I'm a big, big fan of what I've built here today. I believe that this is all the time we have for today, but uh, myself, Bitha, and Tango all got up to some cool stuff in the nether, as you will have seen in that clip that I did with uh, uh, Bitha in at the beginning, like the second clip in this episode or something. And, um, yeah, so where we had to maybe try and move a ghast or something, I'm probably going to just put it up in clips. Um, because let's just say it didn't go quite go to plan, but um, yeah, I'm going to leave you guys with this. Like the video if you have enjoyed. Remember to comment down below if any ideas you have for this area or any other area in the uh, the thing. I love using your guys' ideas, and I will credit you if I ever use them in the future. But I mean, anyway, I will catch you later. Enjoy the next clip. If Tango wants to join. Oh, have you got the potions? How many have you got? Uh, I got three. No, oh, six. Okay. Amazing. Six. Chuck them on us. Chuck them on us. I have a pick on my hot bar. Thank you all. Oh, oh, boing, boing. Hey, Tango joined. Hey, oh, what? Thank you. Oh, Tango got it. <laughs> Hello. Hey. We can't hear hey, you. Hey, guys. Oh, Hello. we can hear you. Hey, -o. How are you doing? Good. Just my morning stop in. I don't have time, obviously, but what are you guys doing? Well, if you grab a grab an invisibility potion, you can join us. Yeah, you you might have my one. <laughs> I think I think Tango's got one. I gave you yeah, one. Yeah, 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 yeah. You've got you picked up my one as well, I think. All right, we have to take off our armor, right? Well, I don't know. We were just Thank discussing you. this. I've been pretty sure you got to take off oh, armor. Whoa. Where did that go? I, it's gone over there behind you. Keep, go over the other side of the rail. How did, how did it get over there? Behind Azuma. There you go. Yep. Yeah. Who's going to test it first? I'm going to just empty. Yeah, wait, my these are night vision. Are so they supposed to be? Oh, you got Visibility. I've got the spider eyes. The wrong thing. I haven't got the sugar and the mushrooms though. I've got... Sh oh, let me... Ha yeah, come back to mine. I've got some... <laughs> I can show you what I've got the other side. My patented gas catching device. What's uh, what's invisibility then? What do you You've use to make You've got to add those? the uh, fermented spider eyes to the night vision. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. I forgot about that step. Wait, is that cactus going to work? Is that going to break the car? Yes. So when you come hmm. through... <laughs> Oh, you jumped on the... If you, oh, there you go, that's what'll happen. So he'll come through and hit that plate, ah, and this yeah. will come in and pick him up, and he'll stop here in the cart. Job done. I've tested it in single player Zoom, it'll be quiet. Oh, this is the official guy for the museum, <laughs> huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice. He wants to say something, I can tell. <laughs> Who, me? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that's just really waiting bad. to see what happens. I was literally being quiet, thinking I won't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect, okay. uh, oh, chuck the spider eyes on me and I'll make the thing. Yeah, yeah, I've got Has you. anyone got spider eyes? Oh, good. Thank you. A whole load of them. They need to be fermented. You need some brown mushroom and sugar. I know. It's like you <laughs> think I'm an idiot. <laughs> there you go. Oh, I'm sorry. We'll have plenty of potions in a minute. I'm hoping these will stay eight minutes. We'll see. Don't look at them. Then they'll brew quicker. <laughs> oh, they stand down. Are they eight minutes still? Yeah, there's still eight yep. minutes. Oh, cool. Okay. Don't need no redstone. Um, so I got three here. No. You no, should have six. five. There's six altogether. Thank you. Have a couple each then. Thank you all. Oh, this one's night vision. Eight minutes yeah. should be enough, shouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Should be. Hopefully. It should be. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> okay then. Let's go. Who's going to be the uh, the guinea pig and poke the head over the top with the armor on? <laughs> I'll do it. Morning. I'll be a willing victim. Just don't touch the pressure plate on the way through. <laughs> don't touch it. Squeeze Shut in. up. There we go. I didn't. <laughs> what? You didn't what? <laughs> oh, God. oh God, the cactus! Don't touch the cactus. Yep. <laughs> okay. Oh man. Oh, we've got to have some rails to put underneath him to get him on the. Okay. Yeah, I've got some rails. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We go right, am I going in first? Uh, just put your head over the top, see if he sees you. Oh, no, he sees me! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, the door is shut. <laughs> yeah, let me try that yeah, again. Try now. See, we can see you. Oh, there you go. There you go. Oh, wow. Oh, nice. right, I'll take mine Standing in. inside the ghast. Oh, I can nudge him over. 
Okay, Let's hang on. See where don't, it needs to connect as well. Don't nudge him this way. Let me. You've got to be able to play some. <laughs> we'll just wait here. Stand awesome. back a bit. Uh, you have some half slabs <laughs> on you. Um, I was just thinking that. Yes, I do. Yeah, the half slabs sort of need to go down here where I'm standing. Yeah, so one in front, then one to the right. Uh, towards you. No, no, one in front, then one to your right. Okay. Excellent. Then put put down uh, regular rails on those. Yeah. It's really strange standing inside of a ghast. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Damage. Oh, take damage. Oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <sighs> Do you know whose well. fault that was? <sighs> that was my fault. I'm sorry. I just started nudging him without thinking about what was in front. <laughs> Oh, oh god. god. I've just spent all afternoon trying to get ready. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Why did you invite me? <laughs> the tears are real. Oh. I don't and you didn't get even a get a ghast here. I don't want a ghast in my museum anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care anymore. Oh. I've had enough. Ah. Oh. So I'm sorry. What did, to, what did you do to get him in here? <laughs> We'll have to get another one off. to spawn on the ice bar. Oh, I don't know why I did that. I just <laughs> thought, oh, rail's a place, let's move him. You've run uh, off as well, guys. haven't you, in case we kill you? <laughs> <laughs> I know he's up, he's up there, he's up there. Whatever he is. <laughs> run! <laughs> get him. Oh, <laughs> oh man. Well. Oh, man. What is this? Oh, dear. Oh, well, I wonder we'll, if we'll you can... Again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Where does this... Um... I don't know what to say. Where does this portal go that's here? Is this... Uh, that goes to the spider farm, although it's been disabled. Okay. I'm just thinking I might just build this room up to full-size blocks, leave it closed off, and just hope that one spawns in it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you what, there's a chance that there will, and if uh, if we see it, we can come along and grab it. Yeah, do we need to name no. tag it? Or... If you see it, put it in a cart and leave it alone. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> well, if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have this this one, would you? So Actually, no. That that leave it give alone. Give and take. That, that's that's that how it works. Give and take. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a gas for you. <laughs> <laughs> when I said leave it alone, I mean Izuma. Anybody else can, you know, help oh. themselves because you're not idiots. What have I like... done? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, oh, there's lava down here. Don't fall in. <sighs> oh man. Oh, I'm gonna tell my grandkids for years to come. <laughs> Please, Daddy, Granddaddy. <laughs> uh, tell us what about evil Azuma again. Like a noob. <laughs> ah, yes, the Azuma is a noob story. I love telling that one. So, Gather hey, round, why, children. while you guys are here, what's, hmm? what do I gotta do to get a dog down to uh, to the Wither Skull Farm? Is it, is you need, this like I think you need one of your own. Yeah, this is Azuma's mm. dog. Okay. Um, well, because I had one of then... my own. Uh -huh. So I had to breed it with this one to okay. get more of them. But I think you need one of your own in the first place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which or two. If you have two, but, you yeah, can just breed two. them. Yeah, yeah. So, so true, of course. this is Azuma's dog, did you say? <laughs> <laughs> It'd be a shame if something oh. were to happen to it. <laughs> Look at its Hello, face. boy. <laughs> <laughs>